Hi there. Thank you very much. Uh, Dr. Fauci, can you talk a little bit more about what you think the data show now of the need for shot beyond a third dose, beyond a booster? As you know, boosters are being given as early as five months. We are approaching five months uh, now for some of the first folks who got it. What do we know about how often or if further shots will be needed going forward, and in particular, whether we might need specific types of shots for any variant? Thank you. Yeah, yeah, thank you for that question. That's obviously an issue that have been followed very closely because, as I've said in answer to questions on previous press conferences, similar questions, is that you follow individuals for a period of time after the third dose and you measure a number of phenomenon. You measure laboratory phenomenon, but you measure the real world data on the efficacy in preventing, for example, hospital visits as well as hospital Organizations. And I believe that you're going to be hearing data about that as they data become available, and that should not be within a very long period of time. I think you should be appreciative of the fact that when you're talking about any decisions that will be made, and I'm not anticipating any of that now, but it has to be put into the context of whom you are talking about. For example, there may be the need for yet again another boost, in this case, a fourth dose boost for an individual receiving the mRNA that could be based on age as well as underlying conditions. So I don't think you're going to be hearing, if you do, any kind of recommendations that would be across the board for everyone. It very likely will take into account what subset of people have a diminished or not uh, protection against the important parameters such as hospitalization.